You heard me tell the story with the lion and gazelle. You still stuck. You're a gazelle. You are, you are a gazelle. You need something to motivate you. What happens to the gazelle when the lion ain't chasing him? What happens is he nothing. He stops running. Why? Because he always needs something external to motivate him. There are a lot of people, you're not successful in life, not because you ain't got talent, not because you ain't got skills, but your character ain't right. And I've told you this before, that if you're not careful, your talent will take you places that your character can't keep you. So what's your motive? The reason why you can't get up at four o'clock in the morning, the reason why when I say get up at six, you're looking at me like I'm crazy, is because you don't have that thing that's driving you, that's pushing you to say no to the alarm clock and wake up no to the snooze button. When, when you get that extra assignment, that extra lap, the reason why you can't do it is because you don't have the right to that motive that's pushing the action. What's your why? Somebody came up to me. They said, E.T., man, I'm tired. I put in the work, E.T., I'm not seeing the results. I did what you told me to do. I read the book you told me to read. I put in the hours you told me to put in. E, I'm doing it, and I'm not seeing anything. Listen to me closely. Why do you do what you do, and that's so important? It's not enough just to be a doctor. You got doctors who got terrible bedside manners. Terrible. You got lawyers who are skilled but arrogant. If we talk about character right now, what's your motive? What moves you? What drives you? And whatever it is, sports, life, business, whatever it is, health, listen to me very closely. You got to change that mindset.